This episode of Penpoint starts right now. This episode of Penpoint is brought to you by Netflix. Go to www.netflix.com slash pen to get your free trial membership. Uh, there's a life form. If you're getting your news from me, I want to make sure I cover this. There's a life form based on arsenic. There's, what, six building blocks um, that are used for DNA and stuff. You know, there's carbon and stuff. And then there's phosphorus. <laughs> and they found this crazy ass microbe that in place of phosphorus uh, uses arsenic. So arsenic kills most things on earth. This thing thrives on it. And it actually goes into part of the building blocks of life that make the, uh, that make life. And does this make it more likely that there are, is life uh, somewhere else in the universe? Yes. Absolutely, it's more likely there's arts, uh, life somewhere in the universe. And on top of that, it makes Darwin, you know, probably the most important scientist, smartest scientist that ever lived, you know, uh, along with his guys that helped him, uh, puts him up even higher. The idea of evolution is even heavier than we thought before uh, dis discovering this uh, arsenic life form. And uh, there may be you know, life on other planets. The problem is that when we say intelligent life on other planets, we're talking about life that would give a fuck about us, you know, which is a very specific kind of life. I mean, there were even people, I mean, most people living on this planet don't give a fuck about discovery and going places. Most people on this planet don't want to go into space. I read, uh, I read the book, you know, um, by uh, Mary Roach about packing for Mars. I no longer want to go to space. Uh, I don't even really care much about sending signals out to space. I consider myself inquisitive, but I don't care that much. So yes, the chances of life on other planets with this arsenic stuff, that I mean, we can estimate the chance, the chances have not changed, of course, but we can estimate the chances as higher than previous because now we got arsenic as a building block and there'll be more stuff found than that because evolution is just so much heavier and cooler than we thought. But, and I try to tell Lance Burton this, because you know, when magicians get together in uh, Las Vegas to talk, uh, like master magician Lance Burton, we talk about the possibility of life on other planets, because we're certainly not gonna talk about good magic shows we saw, right? Exactly. Uh, as I said to Lance, it, it's very likely that there's life and advanced life forms on other planets, but we will never know about it because of that speed of light thing. You know, the speed of light, if that's the fastest anything can go and something is 30 million light years away, we send a message 30, 30 million years, we get an answer back from that message. I mean, that is worse than dial up. Anybody remembers dial up, you know, worse than that. So uh, uh, I tried to explain to Lance Burton that even if there is life somewhere else in the universe, it's very likely we could never know about it. Not that we won't never know about it, won't never, won't never. But we, we could not ever know about it, ever. And Lance just said, well, we got to figure out faster than light, uh, faster than speed of light got to figure out how to go as fast as the speed of light. So Lance Burton has now um, uh, stopped doing his show at the Monte Carlo. He's no longer doing uh, his magic show. And if you're wondering what Lance Burton is doing now, I guess he's working on going faster than the speed of light. And then this arsenic thing means that Lance Burton is more likely to discover life on other planets, but still not intelligent. Go to www netflix.com slash pen to get your free trial membership. You should be using Netflix, man. You really should. With more than 12 million members, Netflix is the world's largest subscription service, streaming movies and TV episodes over the internet and sending DVDs by mail. For $8.99 a month, Netflix members can instantly watch unlimited TV episodes and movies streamed to their TVs and computers and can receive unlimited DVDs delivered quickly to their homes. With Netflix, there are never any due dates or late fees, and that's for sure. They get them to you quick and you can keep them forever. I still got one of the Monkeys episodes, one of the Monkeys DVDs that I've been having forever that I'm finally going to get around to watching because I love Mike Nesmith. 
Members can select from a growing library of titles that can be watched instantly and a vast array of titles on DVD. Among the large and expanding base of devices that can stream movies and TV episodes from Netflix right to members' TVs are Microsoft Xbox 360, Sony's PS3 game consoles, and the Nintendo Wii console. Find movies you love easily. I watch them right here on my iPhone and also on my iPad. That's where I watch them. And I stream them directly and they never glitch, they never skip. It always looks beautiful to me. It's just, it's just amazing. I mean, this is the part of living in the future. Netflix is living in the future. I mean, I've got my two kids, all I need is my flying car. And with Netflix, I'm living in the future. As a Netflix Unlimited member, you get DVDs by mail in about one business day. Watch as many movies as you want, shipping is free, and there are no late fees or due dates. Unlimited plans start at just $8.99 a month. As a new member and a PenPoint viewer, you can get a free trial membership. Go to Netflix slash pen and sign up now. Be sure to use this URL so they know that we sent you.